talk about the dead drop tournament today uh we had it just last night it was operation maximum damage the first ever tournament for dead drop it was hosted by boom.tv and before i say another word i want to say that i had an absolute blast i loved it i think it was great for the community we had a ton of people playing games were get uh forming very very quickly the lobbies were more full it was a much better testing ground for for the game i think period and then uh, i'm gonna give my thoughts on the actual tournament the rules the experience of it and i want everybody watching the video who played or watched the tournament to uh, leave their comments in uh in the comment section of this video because i'm recording this on twitch but i'll be uploading it to youtube later as i do very often so overall again i had a blast and i just want to say thank you to everybody who joined me who cheered me on who followed us during the stream subbed up during uh to us during the stream i was the most watched dead dop streamer through the whole thing and i was honored uh to have so many people here with us uh watching and uh talking about dead drop that's what i'm here for i'm focusing so much on dead drop and i have this dedicated dead drop youtube channel midnight mayor uh because i think this game is going places and the sky is the limit and i'm so psyched to be part of this community and uh this tournament uh, was everything that i wanted it to be really uh i do have some some thoughts and feedback to share though uh so first of all um again i had crazy fun and i want to say that i would love to see midnight society have one of these every single snapshot uh summit gupta the, the one of the founders of midnight society uh is also uh one of the or actually the owner of boom.tv so this makes sense to continue this partnership i think it worked great and uh again the community spirit and um overall experience was great i will say that the scoring and the format in my opinion was fine i i had no problems with the amount of i think uh amount of what am i what am i trying to say with with the rules they were what they were and i think it was fine no but no, this isn't the algs this isn't the hds or cdl um this is a game is still actively in development and some of the critiques that i'm hearing about the tournament are are stuff that you know i i feel like you get those with any esport you get those with any tournament there's no perfect system right and a lot of people get discouraged when they don't win and so on but that's that's competition for you so the whole scoring system the format was fine i thought the whole um you know you post your best three games and you get three hours of play thing was totally totally fine i think that worked well it gives everybody a chance you only got to have three good games and um and you're you're good uh, i think the one thing that comes into question and I, I i agree this is a valid question and i'd love to hear everybody's opinion on this is because it's not a battle royale game or an arena shooter this is essentially an extraction shooter where you have a stash um that that comes into question should you be allowed to uh start these tournaments with a stash with a hundred different uh you know fully kitted guns sniper rifles assault rifles um or should everybody start with a clean stash like just nothing and you you have to loot and build your stash throughout the tournament i don't know where i stand not to be honest with you the people who put in the work to get all those weapons this is an extraction shooter um that's kind of part of the game is looting and getting out and extracting right they put in the work it was within the terms of service it was not against the rules um so i definitely don't think it was in poor spirit or cheating in any way shape or form uh those people put in work they prepared and i assume they did better for it um uh, if you want to go in a true competitive environment from that standpoint uh everybody starting with the same amount of stuff in their stash would be slightly more quote unquote competitive am i upset about this no this game is uh again it's very early in development it's a different style game we're not we don't even really see tournaments or anything like that in extraction shooters so midnight society is really pushing the envelope here and i was excited to participate at all and to give my feedback and compete so i'm not upset i definitely could have spent more time you know with, and gotten 40 sniper rifles and 60 uh, assault rifles and, and been ready to go um i don't we don't know with a plate who won yet i i did okay i didn't do too bad oh, i don't think i won but um anyway that's that i do see people questioning the whole stash element and i think that's a valid question for tournaments and dead drop or other extraction shooters going forward and i definitely want to see one of these tournaments for me personally every single snapshot i think it's a great way again to fill the lobbies out get more people excited get more people involved 
And then I also think about, you know, down the road, this is again, down the road, this game's still very early. Uh, will we have tournaments that are duos and trios? That'd be a fun evolution of this boom.tv format. First, we actually got to get duos and trios in the game. We are not there yet. But it's a good question. It's a way they could shake up these tournaments because I, I mean, I'm a, I would be excited to have another tournament this exact same format sometime during Snapshot 5 um and cold storage with the finished weapons and all that stuff but um you know as we get further into development maybe a year down the road two years down the road we'll get duos or trios or whatever and uh you know that would really shake things up and be a new community dynamic which could be really fun as well so uh that's my thoughts overall guys i had a ton of fun i want to see more tournaments and i'd really like to see midnight society play up these uh this this kind of the more competitive side of dead drop because a lot of uh, there really isn't another extraction shooter out there doing that and i have a whole video on the midnight mayor youtube channel about whether dead drop can actually dip into the competitive scene and be a competitive game because that's something that no other extraction shooter is doing so anyway guys i had a ton of fun i was thrilled with operation maximum damage i want to do it again i'm still excited about it today uh my spirits are high it was great to play with you all compete with you all have you all in my twitch chat and with that said, we're going to be moving on with the rest of the stream. But that, those are my thoughts on Operation Maximum Damage. Let me know in the comments if you're watching this on YouTube. What you thought about it. Uh, what's your feedback? What could be improved? And so on. And I'm actually going to do a video soon about the current uh, weapon meta, if you can call it that, in Dead Drop Snapshot 4. Probably going to change in, in a Snapshot 5. But I felt like this tournament was a really good chance to really put these weapons through the test. And I did just that. And I want to give my feedback in video form. Uh, so that'll be my next video on the channel. And now the stream goes on.